Welcome to the Redefine FX YouTube channel everybody. If you are completely new here, my name is Jesse and today I'll show you how to do volumetric light and add fog to your scenes in V-Ray. So I'll just use this simple building that I made and first we want to give it an infinite floor. So under create V-Ray, just add a V-Ray plane and you can just open the V-Ray material library and just assign like a random ground material add to selected objects. Then we can just go under lights, V-Ray, and we need to add a V-Ray sun. So we just drag that to sort of point into our windows and you can say yes to add the V-Ray sky. Raise that up a little bit. And let's go under rendering environment and add the V-Ray exposure control. Scroll down and again click add here under atmosphere and add the V-Ray environment fog. Say okay. And now we can just enable the V-Ray viewport IPR and basically you want to increase the fog height to cover your entire object so I'll just set this to maybe 500 centimeters so that's five meters and I'll just switch into a camera that I created inside the building so we can see the sun rays so we are inside the building right now but everything is too dark and that's because the fog is too dense so this fog distance also means fog density so if I increase the fog distance I'm basically decreasing the fog density near the camera and so I'm revealing the scene slowly and to get those nice rays to show up there are a few things we can do number one I will just adjust the position of the Sun decrease the distance again to make the fog a bit thicker right so I'm starting to get those nice rays to show up then you can also play with this fog transparency so the more black you make this the more opaque the fog will be the more white you make it the more transparent it will be right so you can see how that works so i'll just make it pretty dark and then we just need to increase the amount of light sort of passing through the fog so what you can actually do is just lower the f number for the exposure control to brighten up the scene so i'll just keep dragging this down until i get those rays to start showing up nicely so maybe let's just do three for the F number and here you go here are your nice volumetric lighting sort of God rays and you can of course play with the Sun position um, to see how that moves in real time this fog emission parameter is just a way to fake global illumination passing through the fog which can take a long time to render but you can just increase this value into more wider values and it will brighten up the fog as if there's more light passing through it so if you had like a city scene and there's a lot of light pollution in the city you want to just fake that there's some global light going through the fog you can do this by just increasing this value or you can also just enable the scatter gi which will use actual global illumination lighting we covered the fog height so if I make this let's say just 30 centimeters I'm only gonna get the fog on the ground then down here the ray filter you can say if you want the fog to influence the background or not obscure the background so you can see what happens when I turn it off the sky is completely clear if I turn it on the fog is there covering the sky and to speed up your rendering you can exclude the fog to be reflected in your reflections for your objects refractions shadows and lastly you can also exclude lights um, from influencing the fog so right now the fog is illuminated only by the Sun but if I create another V-Ray light in here maybe just to brighten up the room and I don't maybe want this light to be influencing the fog I can just say add hit H on your keyboard and just select the V-Ray Sun and then you need to uncheck use all lights and it will only use um, the V-Ray Sun to influence the fog but you can see the floor is still illuminated by the light so it excluded this light from illuminating the fog and if you wanted to make this more like a night scene you can change the filter color for the Sun and maybe make it like a dark blue maybe like a light blue you can play with that right you get the idea and you can make it more sort of a evening style scene so I hope that you guys found this helpful. If you did, as always, I would appreciate a thumbs up. If you are completely new here, again, welcome. My name is Jesse. There are a lot of tutorials on the channel that you can check out. Don't forget to subscribe because I'll be uploading more tutorials. And I'll see you in the next one.